If you catch it, I'll give you 20 bucks. What is up guys and welcome back to the vlog. Surprisingly, it's actually a really beautiful day in Las Vegas today. The live stream starts in 20 minutes. You guys that are watching this now, if you didn't see it yesterday, unfortunately, you've already missed it. But Devin and I are headed to Albertsons right now. We gotta pick up some potatoes. We got the potato gun in the back, the paintball gun. We're gonna head to this empty field. Uh, shit, did you grab the starter fluid? Yep. All right, Devin grabbed the starter fluid. Thank God he remembered to grab that. We're gonna head to this empty field and shoot the dildo and potatoes out of the potato gun. You guys know when I posted my video of us shooting the dildo out of the potato gun, YouTube actually removed it and not only did they remove it but they age restricted it so when they decided that they were gonna put it back on my channel it is still age restricted so I hope you guys enjoyed the live stream if you saw it I'm kind of gonna vlog a little bit of it that I can like with the potatoes and stuff obviously not the dildo so you guys can look forward to that in a few minutes you see the dildo over there yeah. I gotta try to angle both these at the same time it's kind of hard you got it They shot a lot further with the other one. Yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of disappointing. Want me to go out there and you shoot me? Oh, how about you try catching a potato? All right. All right. Rach, come record. If you catch it, I'll give you 20 bucks. Oh, shit. <laughs> Yo, that one went way further. What was that? A potato. No, what did you shoot? Chloe? Hairspray. Come here. Fuck. What? I pushed it in too far. Again! Fuck Cody! Fuck you! Griffey, you stay down here too. Oh shit! Uh -huh. I got it out anyways! <laughs> Damn, it was that went far! Go get it, Griff! Go get it! 20 bucks if you can catch it! Alright! <laughs> she keep yelping? Barely. I don't know why she gets scared of it. I know, she's just a little baby. Oh, okay. Oh, that one didn't go that far. What the fuck? Oh, good aim. Oh, babe. Good aim. Yeah, you like that? Can I try? Yeah, I never, I never, I mean, I have shot one before, but not recently. Yeah, put the G7X down. Not too sure, like, why there's such a bad glare on my camera screen, but I hope you guys enjoyed that live stream. Little bit of footage. Chloe almost fucking ran away, but Devin ended up catching her. And uh, it was overall, I thought it was pretty fun. It was a good time. And uh, thank you to every single one of you who came and watched. I really, really do appreciate it. I think I might start doing a live stream once a week and just do crazy shit live for you guys because it's it's different than the vlogs because it's raw footage. It's not edited. If you fuck up or make a mistake, you just sound like a dumbass. We just got back not too long ago. Rachel's finished packing everything up. Griffey is being such a helpful boy today. So is Chloe. Both helping mama pack. I'm gonna miss you guys. I'm gonna miss you crazy kids. Rachel's kind of got this suitcase overstuffed. We're gonna have to bring two of them, it's looking like. My it just sucks because we need winter clothes and the winter our clothes are so thick that it takes up a lot of space. We might have to buy some hoodies and stuff when we get to New York. Or I might have to bring a carry-on too to put your GoPro, my makeup bag. I could probably put I could probably fit that all in my backpack. Or maybe I'll get like a little carrying case for all that stuff. Okay. We'll see. We'll figure it out tomorrow. It's gonna be a lot of suitcases, that's for sure. Yeah. The winter clothes are literally so big. Yeah, like, definitely. This. this is just for sure in your underwear. I know. Oh, and like two pairs of pants. Yeah. But. But. It's alright, we'll figure it out. How many times are you gonna watch this fucking movie? Just you just watched this like twice yesterday. I've been packing, so I haven't really been like watching it. This is a good movie though. I this is Polar it. Express, right? Yeah. Yeah, this is a good like little Christmas movie. I love Christmas movies. Not when you watch it every single day though. <laughs> it, get, it gets a little out of hand. I'll watch this over and over again. Not me. We're trying to figure out what we're gonna be having for dinner tonight. We really didn't want to cook, but we're tired of eating out and eating fast food, so I think Rachel's gonna head to Walmart. And she showed me this recipe on Pinterest that looks really, really good. Shredded chicken parm sandwich. So she's gonna head to Walmart, pick up all the stuff that we need to make this. I'm gonna to toss her the camera, and then she's also gonna record her making it when she gets back, so that if you guys ever decide you wanna try some really good food, you guys can just follow along to the video. Walmart is already so crazy. Look at this. So I got everything I need. I got chicken, I got sauce, I got Texas toast, I got salad, carrots, 
Bananas is for the dessert. Sweet tea for Cody. Okay, no joke guys, I was literally in line for 25 minutes. 25 fucking minutes. Shredded chicken parmesan sandwich. You would get Texas toast, Maz cheese, parmesan cheese, oregano, salt, and basil. I'm making parmesan roasted carrots. Carrots, butter, parsley, parmesan cheese, and garlic. Then you need two teaspoons of mixed garlic and pop that in the microwave until the butter is melted. Place your carrots on the baking sheet. And me, I'm just gonna sprinkle some parsley into the butter. Babe, it smells really good. Thanks, babe. You move your carrots around so you get pretty much all done. Right, I'm gonna stick these in the oven for 15 minutes. All right, checking on the carrot. Shake the pan a little bit so it moves as, moves the carrots around. Chicken's cooking. Buying Ferraris and shit. Buying Ferraris and shit. <laughs> I only drive the A28. So I just pulled out my carrots. They are done. Just sprinkle them with a little bit of parsley and voila. Carrots are done. Chicken's still boiling. While the chicken was cooking, I actually put my Texas toast in the oven. They're done. Cooling off. Usually I let the chicken cool down a little bit, but I'm just gonna start shredding it now. as I was showing you guys, I think. I don't know what you guys got last. I put in the sauce, and then I put one fourth teaspoon of basil and oregano. It is supposed to be onion powder, but I only had minced onion, so I did two pinches of that and a pinch of salt. And you let it simmer for about five minutes, and then you add the chicken. Now the moment of truth is testing out this chicken parm sandwich to see how Rachel did. Is this the kind of bread you're supposed to put it on? Mmm. That was really good. Really good. Thanks, babe. We are leaving at 4 a.m. to catch our flight to New York Monday morning, early Monday morning. And we still have a ton of things to do today. I need to head to the barber shop. I need to go pick up a few more things before we take off. I think Rachel's going to end up bringing Griffey to the vet today because he has a little rash on his stomach and it's not seeming to go away. So we're going to bring him to the vet, get it checked out, see what it is. It might be like a food allergy or it could just be because it's getting so dry in the house with the heat on that his skin is not moisturized enough and he's kind of having like a little reaction. But that is going to wrap it up for this vlog. I hope you guys are excited that I'm taking you guys to New York with me. It's going to be awesome. You guys are going to be able to meet my family. For those of you who haven't yet, you guys are going to be able to meet my daughter. I think my buddy Zach is going to be coming up to New York too so we can shoot some cool ass videos for you guys. Shout out of the day is going to be going out to Tyler Fortenberry on Instagram. He's always liking every single one of my pictures I post on Instagram and he's like one of the first people to like him so I'm almost positive he has my post notifications turned on. If you guys would like to be shout out of the day, follow me on all my social media accounts and be active. That can always better your chances at being shout out of the day. I need to hurry up, get this vlog uploaded so I can head to the barber shop before they close. So I will see you guys tomorrow.